Hello Bugs, it's KP and I'm back with a How I Plan in my Erin Condren Life Planner for the week of June 8th through June 14th. Um, by now, if you are an Erin Condren uh, fan, you have seen all the sneak peeks and videos and everything going around for the new Life Planner. Um, yeah, and the excitement is real <laughs> for the new one, but I'm holding steady with the one I have until at least November, um, because that would just be a waste of money to me, but all the new changes are really awesome. But before I get into the video, I just want to show you guys a few other things. You know, I like to share with you some of the new things and so forth, so I did switch covers, um the beginning of June so I'm using the there are so many beautiful reasons to be happy um, and I had the custom colorway with lemon and hot pink I love it it's so summer and pretty and I just love this cover this is probably my favorite of the ones that I've gotten so far I ordered these two adorable clips from a young lady on Instagram I believe it's Isis underscore jewels um, but she makes all kinds of clips they were three dollars and fifty cents a piece which wasn't horrible for a handmade um clip the nature that these are so um wanted to share those with you i got an etsy order from exo simply me on um etsy and i'll put the actual shop name information of course below but um, I really like the sticker designs. She had a, I believe it was a 50% off sale that I caught um, last week or week before. I also got these cute um, planner pens. And I was so against these at first. Like, I'm not paying money for those. But um, I've been sucked into it. And these are just super adorable. And these came from BB Crafty Creations also on Etsy. And I think she did a fabulous job. I mean, they are really, really cute. Alright, so getting ready to plan out the week. Of course, first things first, I have to pick out the washi. I decided to go girly and do pink and white this week because I don't have a lot of, I really don't have a lot going on this week um, other than my day-to-day. -day. So I was like, oh, I'll be able to really make this super um, girly fi just because I can. So here we go, the blank canvas, of course, with the vertical Erin Condren design, which I am still on the fence of if I'm going to switch to the horizontal for next year because my Webster's Color Crush is a vertical design, I mean, excuse me, a horizontal design. So I don't know if I want two horizontal planners, even though the Erin Condren will be larger. I don't know. I may stick with vertical. We'll see. Then, of course, I just lay out the washi. So, um, oh, I did. I tried the white that I had at the beginning of the thin, and it just didn't work. It did not cover um, the boxes at all because it was way too light. So, I decided to just go with all pink pretty much here. Um, and I cover my morning, day, and night, which I'll be happy to see go away. Sorry, guys. I was not a fan. Um, and I also, this was the first week that I covered the complete sidebar with washi tape usually i leave that open and do a quote or you know something along those lines of to-do list but i decided to go ahead and cover it all the way up because again this is just um i really wanted to just do like a full decoration for this week then the next step i go into my little etsy sticker pile which i have put all my etsy stickers um by shop into uh these small photo albums so that i can keep them a little bit more organized um and I know what stickers come from where. So, um, But I pulled out the ones that I thought for the most part I would use for uh, this particular week. And then I just plan it all out. So um, really just start putting stickers where I feel like I want them to go like everyone else. These are more of the functional kind of things. And I also lay out any quotes um, or backgrounds that I wanted to use. So here's up close of Monday through Wednesday. Um... Instead of using the normal, today I'm thankful for background stickers that I got, I decided to use the lined little flags that I had and just wrote thankful myself and I'll put something there during the week. Um, the girly sticker I actually got off of a blog for free, um, which I thought was really neat. Um, so that fit really good with my whole little girly theme for the week. 
Um, and then the quote and background kind of stickers were also free printouts that I found. The Hello Darling flag was on a um, set of, I think it was four, from Michael's. They actually were on like a hanger, but I took the hanger off and just put the flag on there. And then Thursday through Sunday, um, I love weekend banners. I use one almost every week. I like them um, <clears throat> to kind of differentiate the days a bit. I did another thankful, um, the little scalloped tab, and then I wrote my own little boxes for the to-do list to give it, you know, just my overall personal feel for the week. Um, so I really, really like how it turns out. I have been searching for... Um, clean brush stickers and I was so happy to find those at 50% off no less so <laughs> yay um then I wanted to uh make an insert to go with the total like girly pink theme or whatnot for the week so I pulled these things out um kind of glued them together you know to see how it all turned out and I decided to make that one um for and use it for the week and I inserted it with a Erin Conjurin coil clip and then I'm using the gold crown um, planner clip for this week because again it just kind of all fits together and there you have it we are all set for the week of June 8th through June 14th like I said I don't have a lot going on so I'll probably do some doodling and just some um, maybe some quick journaling or something in the empty spaces for the week um, and see how things turn out Alright guys, thanks so much for watching. As always, please like, comment, and subscribe. Um, if you are um, an Erin Condren fan and you're getting a new life planner, of course there will be a link uh, in the description box below where you can get $10 off of your first purchase. Um, you get 10, I get 10, win-win for us both. So please definitely use the link if this is your first time purchasing a life planner. Thanks so much. Y'all have a great day.